Twilight Sparkle lived in the enchanted forest, somewhere in England. She is a little pony and a unicorn who has magic powers. When she was a baby, her parents saved her from a pack of wolves. Her parents allowed the wolves to eat them up. Twilight is an orphan. She was rescued by a panther named Bagheera, who became her mentor. Twilight also adopted an abandoned baby dragon and named him Spike. Sometimes, Twilight discovers a tale about Bagheera and his friends, the animals of the forest. Ten years later, Twilight and Spike encountered and befriended a bear named Baloo and his old friend, a teddy bear named Winnie the Pooh. One day, Bagheera sent Twilight and Spike to save Pooh and a mouse named Fievel who accidentally got separated from his family. Once they traveled to America, Twilight and Spike, along with Pinkie Pie, Fluttershy, Applejack, Rainbow Dash, Rarity, Piglet, Tigger, Eeyore, and Rabbit, they found Pooh and Fievel. The animals set off on a mission to bring little Fievel back to his family. Unbeknownst to anyone that Spike refused to tell Twilight that friendship with different animals is nothing but trouble. In New York City, the animals defended Fievel from cats. After the animals scared the cats out of town, Fievel befriended a goofy and friendly cat named Tiger. The little mouse finds his family, and they are reunited. Twilight Sparkle, Spike, and the animals return to England. The mice moved in with them. Months later, Bagheera sent his friend, a young llama named Kuzco, to bring Twilight and Spike to a safe new home away from danger. At first, the spoiled llama refused to be the little pony's mentor, but then the animals are being chased through the forest by timber wolves and jaguars. Applejack saved the others and dropped a boulder on top of the timber wolves. Piglet and Cusco helped each other escape from the jaguars by jumping into a river. Moments after the escape, Cusco defended Twilight and Spike from a pair of sneaky villainous pony brothers named Snips and Snails because they were both being mean to poor little Twilight. After Cusco scared Snips and Snails away, he told his friends he was sorry. Cusco sets off with Twilight and Spike on an adventure to take them to a nice house on the hill. Meanwhile, at Skull Rock, Fievel, Pooh, Tigger, and their friends, Woody and Buzz Lightyear, try to find treasure, but they befriended an Indian mouse princess and her family. When an alien named Scroop threatened to kidnap the Indian girl, Fievel defended her, and Woody sent Scroop fall into a deep chasm. After they bid farewell to the Indian, Pooh and his friends brought Fievel back home with his family. One day, Cusco discovered a wanted poster. It was about Snips and Snails who were plotting to take over the Enchanted Forest. The Pony Brothers lived inside of Big Ben, London's famous clock tower. Later, at a wooden bridge, Pooh accidentally fell through. Cusco saw Pooh being swept away and told Spike that friendship with different animals is nothing but trouble. When Twilight realizes it, she scolded the spoiled llama, and angry Cusco orders her to leave him alone. A sad Twilight ran off crying. Cusco tried to apologize, but he took off to rescue Pooh. As Spike battled Snips and Snails, Cusco and Pooh helped each other escape from crocodiles. Once Spike got away from the wicked pair, the little dragon finds Twilight at their treehouse and told her about the escape. In the forest, Twilight stops Snips and Snails from taking over the forest with a little help from her magic. She allowed the crocodiles to chase the pair away. The animals cheered for the pony girl. Cusco embraced Twilight. As they and Spike head back to the treehouse, Cusco had a plan. He will bring Twilight and Spike to the house on the hill where two married horses named Alexandra and George can adopt Twilight and Spike. One night, after Twilight Sparkle went to sleep over at Fluttershy's home, Spike and Cusco went on a trip to the town of Nottingham. Once there, they encountered Cusco's old friend, a fox named Robin Hood, 
and his band of merry men. The animals helped each other escape from the Sheriff of Nottingham, a villainous wolf. On a cliff, Cusco battled the wicked lion, Prince John, and sent him falling down the waterfall. After they returned into the forest, Spike and Cusco reunite with Twilight. In the winter, Twilight Sparkle, Spike and Cusco befriended an abandoned vixen named Sharpius, who was adopted by a man called the Forester. After Sharpius finds a den to live in, she befriended a cat named Tom and a mouse named Jerry, who got separated from their owners. Tom and Jerry found a new home on a farm. Thanks to little Spike, after spring arrives, Sharpears was married to a fox named Dashwood. Sometime after they had fox kids, Twilight Spike and Cusco rescued the foxes from a poacher named Gaston. Cusco and Gaston fell off a cliff, but Twilight rescued the llama. Weeks later, Twilight, Spike, and Cusco went to live on Kind Widow Tweed's farm. The animals like it there. One day in the forest, Twilight, Sparkle, and Spike befriended a mouse named Miss Bianca. Meanwhile, Bianca argues with a field mouse called Mrs. Brisby, but after they talk about their families, the white mouse and the brown mouse became best friends. Later that day, Twilight encountered a unicorn named Prince Blueblood. The prince tried to force Twilight to marry him, but she rejected him. Spike and Cusco came along, and they took Twilight to Thorn Valley with them. Furious that his plan failed, the vain Prince Blueblood walked away. In Thorn Valley, Twilight, Spike, Cusco, and the animals battled Professor Radigan's gang and scared them off. Once Radigan got to London Town, Bianca and Brisby used their magic crystals to transform into the Wonder Mice. They chased Radigan to Big Ben. As they fought, Bianca's friend Bernard went to rescue the pair. Lunging at Bernard, Radigan fell into the river below. The next day, Bernard asked Bianca to marry him. They are later engaged, because Bianca and Bernard loved each other. <laughs>